the Vatican today as you can probably see it's really dark still because it's only 6 30 in the morning um, our Vatican tour starts at 8 but it takes us about 45 minutes to get there so we don't want to be late so here we are Yesterday we had this box of pizza and the, basically they wouldn't allow us back in, or they wouldn't allow us in because of that box of pizza. <laughs> so here we are.
we just got back here at the apartment and it's currently 10 o'clock in the evening. Hi, Rave. Hello. <laughs> um, that was such a... <laughs> your foot hurts? Anyway, um, that was such a good day. Um, we ended up staying a little bit late tonight because we don't have anything much planned for tomorrow. Tomorrow's more like a chill day. We're gonna go see the Trevi Fountain, Spanish Steps, and then we're also gonna go to Villa Borghese. I think that's how you say it. Or anyway, one of the gardens here in Rome. We're probably gonna rent a bike and just go around the guard, the park, I mean. Um, yeah, that's kind of it. Are we gonna watch another movie tonight? Oh, I don't feel as sleepy. Yeah, yeah, okay, we can then. So we were watching Castaway yesterday. We didn't get to finish because I was so tired. I slept at 8.30 in the evening. So today we're not as jet lagged as we were the last couple of days. And yeah, that's the quick plan for today. I'm gonna go take a shower first, freshen up and prep my clothes for tomorrow and then chill for the rest of the night. Good morning, folks. Today is our last full day here in Rome. My outfit for today, Raven's outfit for today. <laughs> we are off to brunch and then we're gonna go see Trevi Fountain, Spanish Steps, and we're also gonna go to Villa Borghese. Borghese, I don't know how to, how to pronounce it, but anyway, that's our plan for today. We're gonna go back here and prep for our flight tomorrow. So we're gonna, I guess, slightly call it a day early. Uh, we're just gonna have a chill day tonight, probably um, another movie or something like that. Um, while we pack. So, we are off to lunch. Here we go. We're just gonna go around the park on a bike so we can take it slow and steady. Folks, 
we are kind of done for the day. We're just about to go walk to our apartment and prep for our flight tomorrow. Here at the apartment and as mentioned, we're gonna quickly freshen up and then get ready and pack and do all that stuff. Anyway, before we left or right after we left the restaurant, we went and passed by um, this famous Supli shop. So I believe Supli is, has um, cheese and rice inside. This is a classic Supli here. It's shaped like a potato. I'm gonna raise, can you help me rip this up? Like rip this, this, split this in half in front of the camera. I don't know if you can see that. Focus, focus. Three, two. Look at that. Cheers. We Careful, it's still quite hot. Mm. It's good. It's like a, a spaghetti. It tastes like spaghetti, but there's rice and cheese. What do you think? It's tasty, right? It's just so weird that there's like rice and cheese, but it tastes like spaghetti with a rice. red sauce spaghetti. With rice. Yeah. <laughs> but it's good. Here you go. Apartment. Rave. Hi. You ready to go home? <laughs> I'm so tired. So tired. Folks, we literally just made it here in Vancouver. It is 12, almost 12.50 a.m. I'm with Raven. It's been 24 hours since we left the apartment and we started this journey home. We're all so tired. I slept throughout the flight. I know I'll get jet lag, but melatonin is the key. <laughs>